Bites. I am Chef Pashan and I welcome you all. Well, today I am not going to share any recipe with you. But what I am going to share with you or what I am going to teach you today is something that is going to be very useful and it's very important. I am going to start with a series of baking for you. And for that we need to get equipped with few things. So let's see what all equipment you would require to start baking series. Baking is something that you always need to be perfect. For that, if you want all your products to go well, you have to follow some simple steps but something very important. First of all, what I am going to tell you is, is this measuring cup. So basically you have around 4 cups in it which has got different measurements. One is one fourth, the other is one third, then half and then one cup. So this is what you have to do with your refined flour or dry ingredients like some recipes has got like cup measurement. So you are going to be using this whenever you have something related to your cup measurement. Then the next equipment that we are going to require is this spoon. So basically this is a measuring spoon and it has got different measurements. It's going to be useful for you when you are going to use baking powder or salt. So basically this is going to be very important and it's going to be very useful again. The next is the measuring jar or the measuring glass. Now you have all the measurements which you can use for milk or any liquid. So you can use a cup but if you want to be perfect then this is something that you can always use. The next and the very important thing that I have is a sieve. So any bakery product you always have to sieve your ingredient because you always want your impurities to go out. Then the next thing that you would require is a bowl. So basically you would require bowls of various size, various uh, you know it has to be some has to be big, some has to be small according to the quantity of the baking product that you are going to make. But if you are going to start something as a baking for beginners, if you are going to do a, if you are a beginner and if you are going to start to make something for the first time then I think that this size would be cool enough where you are going to use it in a less quantity. Then the most favorite part that comes is the cake tin. So everybody whoever wants to start baking would always think of making a sponge cake or making a cake. So this is something that you get in the market which is called as a cake tin. So you get a different size and different shapes in whichever shape you want a cake to be. So basically you are going to get this and I have something where you can demold the cake easily. So this is going to be useful to you again to just remove the sponge cake easily out. Now if you want to learn some amazing artisan breads then you are going to require this. This is a bread tin. ये अलग-अलग साइज में आपको मिलता है काफी बड़े साइज में होता है ये काफी छोटे वाले हैं इसमें आप रेक्टैंगुलर केक्स बना सकते हैं जो आपको मार्केट में स्लाइस केक मिलता है वो बेसिकली इसमें मिलता है इसमें बनाया जाता है उसे तो आप इसमें ब्रेड्स भी बना सकते हैं लेकिन काफी छोटे साइज में हो जाएगा इफ then what I'm going to require is cupcakes. That is yours and my favorite. I'm sure everybody loves cupcake. Everybody loves muffin. So if you don't have a tray, you can always use the silicone molds, which is easily available in the market. You even get in various shapes. I have got the simple one. Because this is very old one. So you get many in different shapes as well. So you can use this for making of your cupcakes and muffins. These are known as a tart mold. So if you're making those small lovely tart or lemon tart or chocolate tart, then you're going to require this, which you're going to individually make. So basically, you can make one tart and you can put it in your baking tray. Mein rakh sakte ho, and then you're going to bake this. So this, you're going to require for baking of your tarts. The next and the most important thing that I'm going to show you is this four equipment. This is known as a wooden spoon, which you're going to require to mix like if you're making a cookie or something, then you're going to require this to mix. This is a spatula, so nothing goes waste for bakery. If you're using a bowl, and if you clean the sides and you don't want to waste the batter, then the spatula will help you with the whole borders and the side. To clean it and 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 clean it. Then the next thing, this is known as a palette knife. So if you are making an icing cake or something and you are making an icing cake, then you need to give it to the borders and you need to give it to the perfect edges on the borders. Uh, palette knife come under here and this is the greasing brush so if you want to grease any of your tins or if you want to grease the uh, breads so you're going to require a greasing brush the next thing that we would require is this thing which is also known as gloves 
तो अगर आप कुछ गर्म चीज अवन से निकालते हो तो आपको ये हमेशा अपने साथ रखना है बिकॉज दिस इज गोट हेल्प योर हैंड टू गेट बचाओ द नेक्स्ट थिंग दर आई एम शोइंग यू इज दीज लवली नोजेल्स दीज आर नोन एज नोजेल्स ये हम लोग यूज करेंगे हमारे पाइपिंग बैग में आपको मार्केट में दो तरह के पाइपिंग बैग मिलते हैं वन विच यू कैन री यूज इट अगेन एंड दी अदर वन विच इज डिस्पोजेबल पाइपिंग बैग तो ये आपको जो नोजेल्स है वो आपको पाइपिंग बैग के साथ यूज करना है तो जब भी आप एक ब्यूटीफुल सा केक बनाते हो तभी आप ये नोजेल का यूज कर सकते हो टू गिव डिफरेंट शेप्स एंड डिफरेंट प्रेजेंटेशन फॉर योर केक सो दिस नोजेल्स आर गोइंग बी आंसर ओवर देयर जब भी आप बेकिंग करते हो या जब भी आप बेकिंग सीखते हो कुछ चीज बहुत माइन्यूटली आपको ध्यान देना होता है दैट इज वेइंग ऑफ योर इंग्रेडिएंट्स। अगर आप बेकिंग में इंग्रेडिएंट्स को अच्छी तरह से वे करके नहीं लोगे तो दैट्स गोइंग टू स्पॉइल योर डिश या आपको परफेक्ट प्रोडक्ट नहीं मिलेगा तो इफ यू वॉन्ट योर केक और योर प्रोडक्ट वो डूइंग इन बेकरी टू बी परफेक्ट देन यू टू फॉलो दैट माइन्यूट वे तो वो माइन्यूट वेइंग आप कर सकते हो ये वेइंग स्केल से सो बेसिकली दिस इज अंग स्केल और ये आपको एक छोटे से छोटे माइन्यूट से मेजरमेंट्स के लिए हेल्प करेगा हालांकि मैंने आपको दिखाया है मेजरिंग कप मेजरिंग स्पून मेजरिंग जार लेकिन आप हर एक चीज उससे नहीं कर सकते तो एक छोटे से छोटे चीज के लिए आपको ये वेइंग स्केल लगेगा विच इज अ डिजिटल वन यू इवन गेट द मैनुअल वन इन द मार्केट बट वट आई प्रिफर इज द डिजिटल वन दैट यू The next thing that I'm showing you is a cookie cutter. ये आपको मार्केट में अलग साइज के अलग शेप्स के मिलते हैं तो ये सिर्फ एक कुकी को शेप देने के लिए है हालांकि अगर आपके पास ये नहीं है तो आप हाथ से भी उसे बना सकते so no hard and fast rule that you need to have this. This is a pizza cutter. ये तो आप लोगों ने देखा होगा ये pizza को काटने के लिए यूज किया जाता है अगर आपके पास ये नहीं है इट्स ओके यू कैन इवन यूज अ शार्प नाइफ द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग दैट आई हैड एंड आई एम यूजिंग इज the beater so basically this is used for beating of your if you want to make an icing sugar ya agar aap sugar aur butter ko beat karte ho egg ko aapko frothy hone tak beat karna hai to ye aapko madad karega in case agar aapke paas ye nahi hai to agar aapke paas aise milne wale market mein aapko whisk milta hai agar aapke paas whisk hai to aap wo bhi use kar sakte ho but to become a little more professional to become a little more perfect in bakery if you have this then your product is going to turn fantastic I have one more thing to show you is this amazing thing. This is known as a turning top. तो अगर आप केक वगैरह बनाते हो यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू मूव अराउंड द टेबल सो ये आपको काम आएगा जब आप एक केक को आइसिंग वगैरह करते हो सो दिस इज गोइंग टू मूव ऑटोमेटिकली जस्ट यू जस्ट टर्न इट वंस एंड इट कीप्स मूविंग फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम और आप आपका आइसिंग बहुत आसानी तरीके से कर सकते हो आई होप आपके लिए आज का ये वीडियो बहुत ही यूजफुल था and uh, before i start with my series of baking for beginners ya yeah, basic baking for beginners i wanted to go for shopping aur ye sara cheez jo bhi maine aapko dikhaya agar aap ye arrange kar sakte ho aapke liye then it's going to be great it is not too very expensive ye beater ko chhodte hue baki sare cheez aapko lagbhag 2000 rupees tak mil jana chahiye market mein i hope this video is going to be very useful to you and if you haven't subscribed to the channel and if you want to watch such more videos please go and subscribe to the channel and if you have already subscribed to the channel don't forget to hit the like button comment below if you want to know something more please share it with your friends and family because taste bites is all about experiencing food like never before till we meet again happy cooking and stay fit